tomorrow, the state will begin sending those ballots in the mail to people who have asked for them. And the numbers are just staggering. Nearly 10% of all registered voters in our state have requested to vote that way. And tonight, CBS 17 digital reporter Jody McCreary is digging deeper into the numbers in search of just what all those mail-in voters have in common. Just in the past two weeks, the number of requests for mail-in ballots has nearly doubled. And we wanted to know more about who's asking for them. And the numbers just continue to grow at exponential rates. The State Board of Elections says so far there have been more than 600,000 requests for mail-in ballots. Two weeks ago, that total was at 300,000. And state officials expect that number to keep growing. This isn't the first time that we've done absentee by mail. It's just the first time we've done it at this volume. The Board of Elections breaks down the demographic information for people asking for ballots. According to their numbers, more than half are Democrats, while just 16% are Republicans. More than 40% of voters by mail are over the age of 65. And while nearly 70% are white, almost 20% are black. And Bitzer says that's more in line with the percentage of eligible black voters in the state. African American voters have skyrocketed in terms of their percentage of requests for absentee by mail ballots. Those ballots will start going in the mail tomorrow to people who have asked for them. And at CBS17.com, we've got the full breakdown of which counties have the most requests. For CBS 17 News, I'm Jody McCrary.